I'm Mike Bills with Measurable Solutions, and this is Whiteboard Wednesday. Today, we are talking about what is a weekly staff meeting worth? And you're going to ask yourself, why do I need a weekly staff meeting? I'm, that's a whole hour or a whole whatever. I'm shutting down. There's no patience. Do the math. It's $500 I'm losing, etc. I will tell you a weekly staff meeting is worth whatever dollar amount you want to pick, multiply it by three, and that's what a weekly staff meeting is worth. It's really worth it because you get your group together. They're, otherwise, they're working in separate departments all week. You got your clinicians working together. They chit chat and have conversations. You got your front desk working together. They chit chat and have conversations. But you never really get them in a room communicating about the same issues and working together as a team. Think about a, a football team. You got your offense, you got your defense, but they got to work together. Think about a soccer team. You got your offense, you got your defense. And at some point in time, the ball travels back from, from the offense down into the defense. And they got to be able to work together as a team to really win that game. And that's what you're doing. You're playing a game with your practice every week. And you got to make sure that your team is communicating and playing together, right? So that weekly staff meeting is invaluable. You can't even begin to put a dollar sign on it. And I'll tell you, back in the beginning days when I was a private practice owner, I didn't necessarily see the value in it. Oh, they'll talk to each other. They'll figure things out. Nope. The second I put in a weekly staff meeting, we got way better results, much better um, you know, communication between staff, et cetera. So here's what you got to do. It gives you the opportunity for them to get together and share their wins, right? The very first thing we do in a staff meeting, everybody goes around and shares a win. And the reason for that is, think about it, all day long, we're listening to patients. My shoulder hurts, my hip hurts, my back hurts, whatever, right? And a patient comes into the front desk, I need to change my appointment, all these things. And they get so focused on that, they forget about that's one small 10%, 5% of the patient population they forget about the 90, 95% of the patient population that they're helping. So get them all to share a win and they're like, yeah, I love when Joe comes in. Great. Let's find more people like Joe. So share a win, right? The second thing you're going to do is you're going to talk about issues and solutions. Anytime anybody brings an issue to a staff meeting, it's got to be an issue that affects everybody, but you'll be amazed. You get all of your different departments, all of your different staff members talking about an issue and they'll come up with a solution of, hey, we can help you with that. When the patient's in the back, we can say blah, blah, blah. Or hey, when the patient comes back up front to check out, we can do this for you. And all of a sudden your problems start going away because you're solving that, right? Now you see where that three times whatever you're losing, losing in time production time is one back because you got a team that's working together. And then finally, give your team a goal. Give them a target to achieve, right? At the beginning of a game, you know, a, a, a soccer team will say, you know, hey, we're going to score three goals today. So everybody's working together. We're going to win this game three to nothing. Everybody's working to score three goals and prevent no goals. So you get your team working together. They get behind each other. And you'll be amazed. That production will go up. And all of a sudden, that $500 you lost becomes $1,500 of, of gained income over the course of the next week. So if you aren't having a weekly... Not monthly, day, in a monthly, quarterly, etc. If you aren't having a weekly staff meeting, get a weekly staff meeting in place, share some wins, talk about some issues, get everybody involved in the solution, and give your team a goal and a target to hit, and your practice is going to be booming before you know it. So hope this is helpful, and I look forward to seeing you for the next Whiteboard Wednesday. And if you've got any comments or any questions or anything you want to discuss, go ahead and post them on the board right below, and we will get back to you and, and handle that real soon. So take care. Have a good day.